Hello, I'm John Bachman. For the past 25 years, I've worked as the evening anchor for WHO TV 13 in Des Moines. And early in my career, I anchored the news in Cedar Rapids. Over those years, I became increasingly concerned about a trend I saw in what I was reporting. The rise in chronic health care conditions, along with the rise in the cost of the health care for those conditions. This is an issue which especially concerns me, as I know friends, family, colleagues, and acquaintances who are all greatly affected by these costs. I also realize that if costs continue to rise at the current rate, it could compromise the financial security of my grandchildren's future and the future of our country. And that's a price I don't think any of us is willing to pay. Quite simply, there are three main reasons why health care costs change. The first driver is the volume of health care services being used. Overall, the number of times members go to the doctor, have tests run, or prescriptions filled is increasing, and this increases costs. The second major driver is that the cost per service is increasing. For example, increasing prices of medical treatment and certain prescription drugs result in increased spending to support those treatments. And finally, the type of services received is getting more expensive. A trip to the emergency room is far more expensive than an office visit. An MRI is far more expensive than an x-ray. If consumers don't maximize the most affordable resources available to meet their needs, costs rise. That's why Wellmark offers a variety of ways to help manage health care costs, including wellness programs to keep members healthy, tight management of administrative costs to maximize member value, and strong partnerships with healthcare professionals across the state that focus on coordinating care to improve quality, emphasize value over volume, and slow increases in healthcare costs. But Walmart also knows that there is no easy solution to the situation, which is why it has embarked on a unique project to improve the health of all islands. The Blue Zones project was started after intense research into the many reasons people use more health care services. This research clearly pointed to the obesity epidemic as a significant root cause of many of the chronic diseases that are driving up health care use in the United States. Today, two-thirds of Iowans are either overweight or obese, which contributes to diabetes, cancer, cardiovascular health issues, and many other preventable diseases that are driving more people to seek more services. The Blue Zones Project was selected as the best way to help Iowans improve their well-being because it takes an environmental approach to this issue. What does that mean? Well, studies have shown that if you make changes to your environment, all the places where you live, work, and play, you can be nudged into long-term, healthier behaviors. In the same way that our environments have shifted over the last 20 years to create easy access to processed food, growth in portion sizes, and increased time spent sitting or driving in cars, generally without us even noticing this has happened, our environments can also be changed to make it easy to engage in healthy behaviors. For example, think of the vending machines at your work or school. If there are only healthy options available, you are given the opportunity to make a healthy choice without even thinking about it. If restaurants offer a side salad or fruit as the default option on their menus instead of french fries, you're nudged into choosing the healthier option. In both cases, choice isn't taken away, but making the healthy choice becomes easy. Improving our overall health is the ultimate health insurance. And it directly supports Wellmark's vision of the future, where every generation experiences a greater quality of health and improved quality of life. As the Blue Zones project takes hold across Iowa, people living in transformed Blue Zones communities will be more engaged in influencing their individual and community well-being, and will take an active role in making sure their environments, homes, and schools are conducive to a healthy lifestyle. This transformation will be shared community by community and has the power to help Iowans live longer and healthier lives. I hope you'll join me in this exciting effort as we make changes that will make Iowa the healthiest state in the nation. In future segments, I hope to educate you on the Blue Zones Project and keep you informed on how we're all reshaping our approach to taking care of ourselves.